This will be the last step. We talk about geofence and Slack. We are almost there. So that does uh, look at the system map again. Now we have four kinds of uh, devices, which are two Arduino low end tracker and uh, two high end mobile phones. No, now they are doing their job by pushing GPS location to our system. Sometimes we just want to see our current locations for devices. As you can see that uh, see all the points on app. But the most of the time you just want to be notified by a special event. Such as I want to be notified when kids enter and out of school, but keep me quiet for the rest of the time. And I want to that everyone knows when I'm out of office, so my wife can prepare the dinner for me just in time. That's why they went to, we need to set an invisible area on the map. We call it geofence. As you can see that uh, is an area like this and area like this. Then the system will judge when the device location is inside or outside of area. Then we push messages by Slack app to all the members. Okay. As you can see that uh, uh, you notified uh, by Slack to all the members. So in our system design, we have two ways to set geofence. First one is from our track app on mobile phone. It's easy to set up but the setting is only for himself but not for other devices say if you have 100 devices out there you must set 100 times in individually and the biggest problem is that is not possible to set up for low-end trackers like our Arduino devices because it does not have on track app on it. So our low end Arduino trackers will not work in geo geofence. So we need another way to set up geofence on server side. And we only need to set it one time. And it will work for all devices and that's why that I need no red powerful functions and we can do that easily if we look at the system map we do that here and not here and I will explain more detail later and uh, it will include a little bit JavaScript, I promise. Just a little bit. And I will explain from the node functions and you can customize it for your own device. So let's go 